it's explosive. You know, that, that, that's the word I would use because every time I think, feel, everything I do, I know it's right and because, you know, he's guiding me. So word I would use is just, it's, 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 Sikhism is explosive. You know, it just, your soul is just, you know, I'm happy all the time. I would never change anything because I'm so much happier and my life is so much better and going places than it was before I became a Sikh. So I've lost a couple of friends um, back in the U.S. because, you know, coming from, you know, hanging out and doing stuff that you're not supposed to do as far as, you know, drinking and stuff. So they were fine with me stopping drinking before I became Sikh, but then when the turban came on, that's when everything changed. I even lost a relationship that I was deeply in love with, but because I put the turban on and my beliefs changed, they weren't accepting that and weren't um, willing to go through the process with me. So she goes, um, if you don't mind, if we go out again, can you please not wear your turban? And right then and there, I was like, no, I'm not. I was like, I'm not. She was like, you're not, you're gonna, you know, disrespect me for now. I'm like, no, you're disrespecting me and, you know, my beliefs. I so say, you say you, you respect it, but, you know, you're not doing that right now. So probably like three weeks passed. I came home and she was gone. You know, just everywhere I go, someone's greeting me very nice, you know, and, you know, when you, when you greet, greet each other, it's different than in the U.S., you know, Sometimes it's just, it's just, you know, the American way, you know, sometimes when you pass people, they just kind of look down or they get on their phones. They don't want to say hi or anything like that. But here, regardless of what they're doing, you know, and it's just, you know, such a welcoming. It makes you feel good. So three days ago, I was sitting in the Gurdwara. I was meditating. I was uh, doing my Simran um, and it just... The feeling I got was like, who just came and kind of like picked me up. It was like to pick me up and hug me and kind of like just, you knew right then and there, you know, for me, I knew right then and there, it's like, I have to take over. It's like, it's time. And part of me was like, no, you know, no, it's not time. But it was like, it's time, it's time. So got in contact with, uh, with the Gurdwara and, you know, made a phone call, put me on the list and Right when I hung that phone up, I was like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm about to take this. This is crazy. But here I am. So, you know, I don't receive any type of negativity or any racism or anything like that. And I know that surprised, that surprised a lot of people, especially other uh, converted Sikhs, because that's the first question they ask. Or they'll have their own problem. They're like, oh, you know, there's races or this person's racist or whatnot. I haven't received any of that. You know, it's just been a loving community. I have nothing negative to say from my own experience, you know, so I haven't experienced anything. You know, I get the looks from non seeks I don't go lie, you know, they, they, they'll stare at me because they're trying to figure out, you know, is he Punjabi? Is he what? Is he this? You know, he got the turban on. I don't know what he is. He's Muslim, you know, <laughs> and, and, and I'm like, I'm like, you want to say something? And they just like, no, you know, or I get asked the question, but majority, I get the stares, but I think any, this is like my first home because it's like, again, it's such a family-oriented community for me, and all the experience I have is from here. When I go back to the U.S., that's my, that's my second home. This will always, Birmingham, I love Birmingham. It's, it's such a, it has so much history, and just the history of Sikhs even coming here is awesome. You know, it, 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 and I'm just telling them all about it, and my mom just got all emotional, and she goes, Gave me a hug. My dad gave me a hug. He was like, we're so happy, you know, that you found God. My mom was like, oh my God, I thought you, you know, you just lost faith completely. That you just gave up. I was like, no, I was trying to find myself, you know, and I found my, I found Wai Guru.